Triple C! Welcome to the Lions Den! Yo, yo, welcome back to the channel. I am your host, Triple Z. We've been away for the week uh, doing uh, some conferences out in Las Vegas. We got in a few hours ago, and uh, while I was gone uh, last night and all day today, and now the airport's been uh, grinding uh, the arena. And uh, so we are. Going to go ahead and go live and continue the arena grind, hang out, chill out, and uh, have a good uh, evening while I'm waiting on my daughter to get home from work. Wolf MCOC, how you doing? Appreciate you being the first one in. Uh, the Bud Files, what's going on? How are you? Hope you're doing good. Snakey, what's going on? Brewski, what's up? How you doing? Uh, it's Nathan. Hello. How are you? I uh, hope you guys are doing well. Uh, Hero Use was on while I was doing the grind. Uh, now Level Up is on. We'll do that later. Um, feel free to comment if you want uh, uh, to have conversation. Uh, I did put a poll up. So far, the poll is 100% uh, yes. Uh, with four votes, is uh, is Prowler worth the grind? Um, also, if you are in my Discord, I am on the stream voice chat. If you want to jump in and uh, have a conversation with me on the Discord, uh, feel free to jump into the voice call if you are in my Discord. Um, so far, we have 139 uh, win streak, and we're sitting at 35 million uh, points so far. Uh, Wolf, no, I have not done any work in 8.4 yet. Uh, every bit of my attention so far has been on this arena grind. Uh, we're using uh, all the arena boost that we have as well and attempting to do our best shot. Uh, we are running suicides and we are putting boost on to help as well with the grind. Uh, so we, we're all in right now. Awesome path. How you doing, man? Uh, appreciate you coming in as well. Uh, again, I am on the Discord voice chat. If anyone wants to jump in, feel uh, free to do so. Uh, we're just going to hang out, have a good time, and uh, see uh, if we can, uh, how many more points we can get uh, till we get back down to the champions that are not really worth the points. And uh, last uh, 24 hours, we've definitely kept the Alliance busy with the help button. I think me and a few other people are grinding right now, uh, trying to get Prowler. Um, I am not Valiant yet, and even if I was, I would not spend $100 to guarantee that I did get him. Uh, have not grinded arena at all uh, to get a champ so this will be our first grind uh, talking to some in the alliance and they feel like the cutoff should be around 80 million so if they feel like that that should be the cutoff then I think I'm going to attempt to try to get a uh, hundred million is going to be the goal. Uh, let's see here. For me, I save up six star shards. Uh, open featured. One of my alliance mates gets new six star from Arena, so it's possible. 
See, I've been uh, saving for the feature, but the last two or three featured um, that has come around, I've ended up stopping before I get everybody. So uh, this featured, I've opened up a bunch on this featured, and I'm still looking for Onslaught and Bullseye so that I can stop. I uh, should have enough to get uh, one more, so maybe at the end of the stream, if I don't forget, maybe we'll open the uh, feature that I have available. But I have not been able to successfully get every one of the feature champ for the last two or three runs. I think uh, when Adam Warlock was in there, I never could uh, pull him. And I ended up just uh, stopping and giving up the grind for it. So I um, figured as much hype as around this champion worked out for me to have uh, some free time last night and a bunch of traveling today that I can put a good, uh, good start on it. So I figured this would be a, a good a chance as any to hopefully have the time to make it worthwhile. The only one I'm missing is Sheila from the latest featured. Last two crystals have been good have been good to me. See the last couple of featured dive open. Um I pulled a silver centurion for the first time and then on my very next crystal I duped him. So I have not been, I've, I've got every one of the featured except for Onslaught and Bullseye. That's the only ones that I'm missing. Um, oh, nice. You did get Cersei. That's cool. Cersei's a really good champ. I think she's more made for defense than offense. But uh, I've been doing some pretty decent work with her in the arena. And I know the arena is not much of anything. Probably a bad comparison. I need to turn my notifications off, I think. So we'll quit getting those messages across the screen. Uh, I'm not one to run suicides either, so this is new territory for me. Uh, we're uh, running suicides for this. I just got to remember to take them off once we're done with this grind. And I keep parrying. There we go. Six votes so far, 100%. Yes, Biscuit, what's going on, man? Uh, much love, brother. Like and share. I do appreciate the like and the share. Hope you are doing good. Happy Friday to you, my friend. We are running low on our boost because we've been hitting uh, a bunch of boost here lately. All right, let's, uh, again, if anybody wants to jump on Discord call, you are welcome to do so if you are in my Discord. If you are not and want to join the Discord, let me know and we will get the link. Um, right now, yes, I am running Recoil. And I'm also running the uh, extra with the uh, poison and the bleed. 
so that we can hopefully have higher prestige and also uh, finish fights more quickly. I was instructed by several in the Alliance that it was worth uh, putting on the recoil for this. I am not a big fan of suicides, but uh, for this grind, we are definitely running re recoil, and we're running the uh, extra attack with the bleed and the poison. So we are taking damage, doesn't matter how much health we finish with, what matters is that we finish the fight without losing. Uh, doing good, good to hear brother, glad you are doing well, appreciate you coming into the chat, means a lot. Uh, I love the gaming community because we have a lot of people in the chat that don't even play MCOC but just like to support other gamers and that's uh, what I definitely like about the gaming communities. We all support each other regardless if we're playing the same game or not. So how's everybody's week been? If you had a good week, let me know. There we go. All right, all right. Cruising right along. got eight likes already on the stream i appreciate every one of those absolutely well we uh are gaining the subs uh very regularly i just finished with uh i think my most productive uh month on youtube as far as analytics are concerned uh we are definitely still in need of the watch time hours so uh Anybody that's able to help with the watch time hours is greatly appreciated. I may end up throwing some uh, live stream replays on uh, just to help get some uh, hours going. And if I do, I'll make sure that it has replay across the screen so that you know that it is not live but a replay. And if I do, I'll try to bounce in and out as much as possible, at least chatting with people in the chat but trying to get creative on how to finish getting these last uh the last half of these watch hours Also, if you've ever grinded arena, how was your experience? Did you uh, meet the goal? Did you get what you was looking for? I think the best thing about arena is all the battle chips that you will be getting from the grind. All right, so this guy's running recoil as well. There we go. Taz, what's going on, man? How are you? I appreciate the good luck. I need all I can get. 
Uh, Artacious Wu, what's going on, man? Going for the six? Yeah, I'm going for whatever I can get. Probably the six star. I probably should have let that fall off. There we go. Yeah, I've never grinded for a champ before. So figured uh this would be a good one to probably get for the first time grinding. Oh come on. Of course you're gonna wait. There we go, it doesn't matter. Uh Let's see. Uh, woo, good to see you. Hope you're doing well, man. Appreciate you coming in. Tips. Know your limit. Schedule your time. And no mercy. Got it. Got it. Yeah, it worked out where I was going to have some uh, downtime last night and today with the uh, traveling back from Las Vegas. So figured it would be as good a time as any to start the grind. Give me just a minute to finish this fight, Woo, and I will read your comment next. All right, come on. There we go. There's Tim Plasma. I think this should kill him. Yes, it does. Foes, what's going on, Foes? How you doing? Uh, nice. Well, if you go for the six star. Uh, stop pressing the help button. Uh, I do hit the uh, auto select and make sure whether or not I do have boost available for them. Uh, but stop pressing the help button that's interesting i uh i guess because of time because it takes up time hitting the help button i've been hitting the mess out of the help button trying to uh get my alliance mates to help me refresh them faster so if there's a tip on that i'm definitely all ears And also, if you are in my Discord, I am on the uh, uh, stream channel. If anybody wants to jump on call. Rizzo, what's going on, man? Good luck, man. I appreciate it. Good luck to you as well. After our conversation, I wasn't planning on uh, grinding. But after our conversation, I, I figured I would go ahead and try to grind with you. Yes, time. Yeah, don't worry about the gotcha. Well, that's interesting. So just come out, auto select, go in. Uh, do you guys uh, take the opportunity to make sure you got class advantage or disadvantage? Uh, yes, mine are coming off the cooldown now. That's why we are grinding right now. Um, I, I grinded, uh, yesterday, last night. And got down to my five-star rank threes, I think. And it was, uh, they were so low that it really wasn't worth the, uh, 
uh, the time running them through because it was just not amounting to a whole lot of points. But if I'm looking at that wrong, let me know. I'm definitely uh, all ears for anyone who has successfully grinded a champ. I'm, uh, I'm definitely open for all the advice. Okay, so you play all your seven stars and then play all your six stars. Gotcha. Uh, as long as you can win your fights, you're good. No mystic could get right. Yeah, a couple of times I did not realize that I had uh, messed up on my selection against a torch fight. I'm so used to hitting that help button. <laughs> it stares me in the face. Also, if you have grinded a uh, four champion, what champion did you grind for and was you successful? MKS, what's going on? How are you? Good to see you. Appreciate you coming in. Appreciate the good luck. I definitely need all the good luck I can get. There is no awesome gameplay here. We're just grinding the arena. If you want to see awesome gameplay, go see Marvel King's channel for that awesome gameplay experience. Also, Marvel King, I'm enjoying your videos, even though I haven't done a whole lot of commenting on them. It's okay, Marvel King. He doesn't know where to find the keyboard. That's why he doesn't oh. comment anymore. Oh, come on in here and burn me. I like it. How you doing, Rizzo? What's up, Triple Z? Oh, just a Friday night grind? Yeah, I'm doing the same thing, man. Just got out the shower. Freaking allergies is killing me, bro. Oh, no. That ain't no good. Yeah, if it gets too bad, I'll probably just hop off. Don't want to interrupt the stream. Uh, you ain't going to interrupt the stream? Yeah, you'll get your prowler. Uh, congrats! Uh, wanted the five star, got the six star for seventy-two million. Oh, for destroyer! Oh, that is a good one. What's up, woo 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 woo? Marvel King, Taz the Immortal. Rizzo the Legend is on call. Absolutely. The one and the only. You will not believe how much Marvel Contest of Champions I was playing while I was working today. Uh, I probably wouldn't. <laughs> it is kind of embarrassing. Well, for what it's worth, I was grinding last night before taking a nap. Got up early, grinded all the way to the airport. And then grinded while we were waiting on the plane. Then the plane we were on was messed up. The controls were messed up. Had to get off that one. Get Jeez. on to another one. Then we flew into Nebraska, apparently. And while we were okay. waiting for them to reload in Nebraska, uh, I sat there grinding until I had to turn it back on airplane mode. Who's that guy? Just shut up, 
What's up, Cisco kid? Uh, crazy. He went for the low seventies. Marvel up, King. Please? Marvel King says Destroyer is mid. I know he's, he's uh, annoying on defense, unless I just don't know what I'm doing. You mid, huh? What's up, Wolverine? Wolverine in the chat. Foes, I got foes in different area codes. Wolverine, how you doing, man? Did I miss him? Seems mm -hmm. like I arrived in time for the Rizzo to collect my dues for the Carnet Club meeting. <laughs> 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 oh. Wolverine, I'm trying to get uh, Rizzo uh, to do a uh, friendly little challenge with me in hopes to get uh, my Karnak for President account unbanned from his YouTube channel. <laughs> but he's being very stingy. <laughs> very stingy. Why don't you get rid of some of those battle chips and then, we'll think of, then I'll think about it. <laughs> We can do it next season. Oh, yeah. You got to get rid of some of them battle chips. You got to offload those bad boys this season. <laughs> I plan on uh, unloading a bunch of them. Yeah, we got man. Dragon Man, Dragon Man, Dragon Man. Oh, I saw that. Congrats on that pull. Yes, absolutely. Yeah, I've been getting lucky out of Paragons. I think that's my fourth or fifth seven star out of Paragon. What? That's that's crazy. These feature yeah, these feature crystals hate me. Oh yeah, the features are rough. I stopped freaking recording. I just was just pulling them because I had no faith. And when I started pulling them for no faith, that's when I started getting everything I wanted. Come on, quit being so passive. How late you staying up for this uh, grind? Uh, haven't really made my mind up. Uh, my daughter is still at work, so I'm definitely uh another hour at least, if not more, till she gets home. All right, let's finish this round. We'll catch up on some chat. Looks like we've got a pretty decent amount to catch up on. Oh, you got him, Marvel King. You got you got Prowler, bro. So where are you at on your uh your grind, Rizzo? Oh, I'm almost fifty million now. You got Prowler? What? Yes, sir. Almost fifty. Okay, yes, that, sir. I'm, that tells me how much you did today at work. <laughs> oh, I've been playing a, too much Marvel at work, bro. Two days in a row. I put up somewhere around 10 million uh, while I was working. Really? Stop. Stop playing with dust. Get out of here. You're going to mess around and have allergies like your dad. All right, let's see what we got here. Bro, I was delivering mail, putting mail in mailboxes and pausing my fights so I could Finish doing what I was doing and then get back in the fight after I delivered the mail. It was bad. Gotcha. If gotcha. someone wanted to rob me today, they totally could have. I was not paying <laughs> attention to nobody. Uh, Prowler is amazing for sure. Punk is good too. Shining Battlegrounds. Thoughts on shower nerf? What a shower nerf. Shocker. Shocker. Oh, shocker. Gotcha. I just didn't read far enough down. I'm hitting the help button while I catch up on chat. <laughs> uh, they ruined shocker, shocker again. Need a rank down ticket. Oh, that's a that's pretty good. Bold statement. Spent over two. Is that 2,000 pounds to get him? Not sure what that is in U.S. dollars, but it sounds like a lot. 
Oh, uh, my buddy got Prowler. He's amazing, both attack and defense. Gotcha. Minnows Minute, how are you, man? Good, Good Snake. All right, we're fixing to get back into it. I think uh, busy, been so busy. Dude, I understand the busy would work. Forgotten, how are you? Good to Forgotten see you. Minnows Minute. Here. You got to download a, a game for yourself to play, Ray Ray. I did for most champs. Uh, I've rewatched the Spider Man series plus seen their own showcases. I like the Spider Man series. I saw Morbius for the first time. Uh, How was it? It was it was good. I enjoyed it. What? I enjoyed it. Uh, I downloaded it and watched it on the plane, so it was definitely uh, the best entertainment in the moment. I haven't seen it yet. Uh, not bad. I, I liked it. Uh, who is on call? Rizzo. Rizzo is on call. Yeah. yeah. All right. I guess they want a lawsuit sooner than later. Someone would lose their cool. I'm down to my five stars now, man. I'm not far from it. I think I'm about about to be pulling some five stars up. I'm going to be up late tonight, man. I got to run my seven stars one more time before I go to sleep. How long do you have before they refresh? Uh, shoot, I don't even know, bro. I gotta look. All I know is that, uh, I was pressing the help while I was delivering the mail, and I seen it was coming up to be ready again, like around three, or, two or three o'clock, and I yep. said, uh, let me go ahead and run them right now. Bro, I sat in my mail truck, my supervisor called me, she goes, uh, <laughs> hey, are you gonna go over today? And I'm thinking, damn it. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I said, yeah, I'm going over today. She says, how much? I said, 30 minutes. She says, okay. I dodged a bullet there. <laughs> and I, funny thing enough, I barely went over. So it wasn't too bad. But your boy is playing way too much Marvel on the streets of Pittsburgh, California today. Well, hopefully nobody that you work for has <laughs> subscribed to my channel to hear you admit that. <laughs> <laughs> And your secret is safe with me. <laughs> I don't see how a lot of people uh, are able to just grind and read chat at the same time. Dude, this is definitely boring. I probably will never do this again. Truly thought it said... Yep, this is trash. Unacceptable was about to rank three, but seeing KT1's video. Let's see. KT1 definitely has a way of pulling uh, some good stuff and bad stuff out in the videos. No way he can oh, take down Maestro now. Even with a few armor shockers struggling to finish fights. Oh wow, is it that bad? And did they give did they just do another update on him that I'm forgetting about? Uh Cisco, yes, he is from California A. Yeah, Pitts Pittsburgh without the H. This is uh Pittsburgh without the H in California. Pitts Pittsburgh I'm not from Pittsburgh, that's just where I work. But in California, it's spelled without the H. Yeah, Rizzo's from the south side of California. South side? What the <laughs> hell? Uh, I don't even know the difference between north and south. I don't know where you at. You're probably right smack dab in the middle of the state, ain't you? 
Nah. <laughs> well, technically, yeah. I mean, the Bay Area is considered uh, Northern Cali, though. Also, for you that are grinding 8.4 uh, and not worrying about the arena, we appreciate that. Yes, sir. Uh, but with that said, how are you liking 8.4 for those of us who are still going to be a little bit before we see it? With any luck, I might be doing uh, that fight uh next weekend Rizzo you read chat yes sir I'm from the Bay Area Hayward oh you an A stack bruh the haystack bruh so you know where that's at all right I am not a quake player shut your eyes this is gonna be rough Hey, not too bad. Uh, yeah, KT1 is good, definitely because he's not a Kabam employee. I do agree with that. Uh, tell him 5 0. Stop. <laughs> I think my internet went down. <laughs> Can you hear me, um, Z? Yeah, I can hear you. Okay, yeah, my internet went down. The only reason I'm refreshing is so uh, I'm, I'm hitting the help button while I read the chat and then going back into it. So if you see me hitting the help button, I'm trying to catch up on chat. Other Where did I that, leave off? Where did I leave off at? I was saying something, but then my internet cut out. Um, The Bay Area, maybe? Oh, yes, I read chat, and uh, I'm 20, 30 minutes from Hayward, uh, Cisco kid. Uh, Minnow's Minute says he's very happy with it. Oh, you already got it 100%. So that means you're valiant now. Tell him to stop refreshing chaps. Yeah, Z, you got to take their advice, bro. Whatever he's trying to tell you, you better listen. This is your first arena grind? Yeah, oh, it's definitely my first arena grind. What made you want to get this arena grind? Uh, all the hype around Prowler, and then after oh, yeah. talking to you, uh, the other day, what the hell? Stupid game! I'm gonna die. Oh, I didn't die, so I lost my streak already. <laughs> I freaking accidentally loaded up uh three four stars at rank one. Yeah, I died. And solid. I'm I'm cool with everything he's saying, buddy. No worries at all. Um, appreciate you looking out, trying to have my back. Uh, but I, I didn't think anything he said was uh was out of line on that. I didn't I didn't read the whole thing. <laughs> I only read some of it. <laughs> oh, that's good. He's he's just talking about me refreshing the champs. And I uh, told him if he saw me refreshing champs, it's because I was reading chat. He said, oh, okay, that makes uh, for a good excuse. Oh. Uh, I didn't take no offense to that. Finger slip. Oh, okay, no problem, man. Just want to make sure we're on the <laughs> same page. Snake, bro. Bro. <laughs> bro. It takes a lot to hurt my feelings. I ain't gonna lie. I've been very fortunate to have a, a good uh, a good chat base that keeps everything uh, in line. 
Bruh, arena sucks. Did you lose? No, I didn't lose. Oh. Now that I said that, I'm fixing to probably lose. Huh? Well, Ray Ray, you can go in the front room. Okay, well, you know how I am, son. My son be trying to bully me, bro. He be trying to tell me to be quiet. No, I lost my streak yesterday. Where where did you get to before you lost it, or do you remember? Uh, I think it was like thirty nine, somewhere between thirty nine and and like fifty something. I don't remember. It was kind of low. But had I not lost my streak, I definitely would have set my personal record. I'm almost to my personal record. I was looking at that earlier. Uh, I've had 160 before. I wasn't really grinding arena. Well, I guess you could say I was grinding for Black Widow Deadly Origin back in the day. Uh, but my roster was nowhere near uh the ability to grind for a champion and be competitive. Right. Uh, so I got up to a 160 win streak and got the five star version of of her. So I'm uh five away from setting a new uh record. Oh damn. Uh chat, what is your arena predictions on this prowler, man? I'm nervous, bro. I want to give up already. What's the what's you're, the arena predictions here? You're over fifty million now. Yes, sir. That's awesome. Yeah, it means I have no life. <laughs> Just completion working on. So how's the uh, final boss? And when I get ready to do mine, uh, Minnow's minute helped me out big time on that. Uh, Serastes fight, understanding it. Yeah, she kissed Serastes. So I need you to uh, be ready to jump on call when I get ready to do that fight. See if we can save about 10 more <laughs> revives. <laughs> 18 million? Oh, we did it. We did it. We're done, Z. 18 <laughs> million is the prediction. Let's do it. We're done. Uh, I wished. I'm almost at 40 million. I was trying my best to keep up with you. I was trying to outdo you last night. I was on Discord call saying, please go hit the button. I got to keep, uh, uh, I got to outdo Rizzo. Yep. And I knew that's what you were doing, Z. That's why I <laughs> lowballed you this morning when you asked me how much I had. Because I remember what you did to me during banquet. Oh, Rizzo, how many points do you got in banquet? Oh, I got a 300K. Well, guess what? Now I got 500K. What the hell, Triple Z? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> oh, I know exactly what, that, what I'm talking about. That's why I lowballed you this morning. I was lying the whole time. I really already had 30 million. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. Yeah. And, and I was and I was honest with you and sent you a screenshot. You sure did. And I was laughing. I, said, <laughs> I was at 34 million before I clocked in. <laughs> I would have been, but I ended up falling asleep and almost lost my streak. <laughs> I was telling Sherbon, I said, Sherbon, don't tell Triple Z. I'm I'm already at 34 million. <laughs> well, he didn't tell me. <laughs> he did not tell me at all. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so some of my guys are refreshing. Oh yeah. We got do, you, bro. Do you notice a difference in the help button? Nope. Getting refreshed faster? Nope. And are you spending units to refresh them any faster? Nope. Damn, Maybe I just either. lost against Kindred. What a bastard, bro. Kindred just whooped my ass. Kindred? I didn't lose my streak. 
Riz said they can get their mail on Monday. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, son? I forgive you. Son, get out of here. Yeah, man. They get they can get their mail on Monday. They don't care. Triple Z is not beating my score. <laughs> so snake grinding too? Nah, snake ain't. I don't think snake's grinding. I think it's just me and you in the alliance. Okay. Mahalo! What's up, Vantage? Vantage, what's going on, buddy? I think Jared was halfway grinding. Yeah, he just needs the units. Uh, you know what's funny is I keep running to your in into your team in arena. Really? Yeah, I've ran into your team at least twice already. You know, I don't even look at that stuff. Yeah, I, it it often gives me the same names. Okay. Well, right now we're whooping up on baby grass. <laughs> yeah, I I run into the same usually the same guys a lot, and I run into you a lot in arena too. Oh, 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 I got you now, Snake. Uh, Rizzo said they can get their mail on Monday because I'm not going to let Triple Z beat my score. <laughs> That's right. I uh, was playing and delivering mail. I know my people was mad at me. Would he just focus on his job? Hell no, not today. All right, I'm in my five stars now. Yeah, we are... We are playing with our baby six stars right now. So do you think it's worth uh, grinding with five star rank threes? How far are yeah, you no, taking? No, yeah, why not? You know, how far are you taking yours before you uh, kind of take a break? I go until I don't feel like playing no more. So you're I not don't, I don't necessarily I don't concerned like, about the star I'm, levels. No, yeah, I just I just go until I don't feel like playing no more. Like my wife isn't here right now. McKay and Ray Ray's here. Ray Ray's here driving me crazy, as he usually does. Yeah, my he wife's in the bed. <laughs> I'm playing with you, Ray Ray. Hey, Z, you need to go use your energy, though, bro. You need to uh, go press the auto on something, man. Just go get some free uh, ISO or Catalyst, whatever you need, bro. Don't let your energy sit there at 70. I hate seeing that, bro. I, I don't know what it is. When my energy's at 70, bro, I go auto farm or just press, like, you know, go to the daily quest and just use, like, 55 energy but the auto button. Well, here you go. Hmm. How you like the, uh, I got a bunch of energy in the overflow. Yeah, I just waste it, man. Uh, I hate seeing it at, at full. Because if it's at full, then you're not, you're just, you're just letting energy go, go to waste, you know? That's why my, uh, my score in the engagement is always so high because, I'll never let that energy just sit there. Even while I'm at work, I'll just auto fire. All right. So we just hit 40 million. Nice. All right. One... If you stay up all night, if you stay up all night, you'll catch me. <laughs> Is that a challenge? No. Okay. <laughs> challenge accepted. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, hey, you got 141k battle chips, bro. I went and got some uh, some uncollected uh, arena crystals this morning. Yeah, pop like ten of them. I pop like ten of them, man. I got uh, 600 units, pal, like that, bro. Really? Yeah, bro. Nice. Uh, not much. Uh, not gonna lie, I was gonna wait till after spring cleaning to get Necropolis done. Looking forward to that. I uh, want to rank go. five Shuri, rank four Aegon, rank four Ascended Juggernaut, and Wong as Let's well. Go. Let's go. Should I save the uh, battle chips for the uh, spring cleaning? 
Let's go. All right. No. All right, let's go. Mind control unblockable. Bro. He's going to go unstoppable in the corner, isn't he? Yep, but it don't matter. That's not a bad plan. So we got 16 votes. 81 say yes, it's worth the grind. 19% says no. That's pretty good odds. I'll start back working on Act 8 uh, on Sunday after the arena. Oh, that's my wife calling me. I'll be right back. All right, bro. Uh, right now, no. I'm putting all my energy into the uh, arena grind. All right. So, uh, looking at my profile, my highest, uh, okay, never mind. I looked at that wrong. I got 160 war MVPs. My highest streak's 191. We just hit 160, so we got to keep it going for another 32 tie, two trips. Let's see. Uh, what's uh, making it such a weird night for you, brother? Be honest with you, my, my whole time zone is messed up right now. I live on the East Coast, and it's uh, 1045, but I was in Las Vegas all last week, which is three hours behind uh, my normal time, so uh, my body still feels that it's only uh, like 7 o'clock, so we may be up late. What we may do is, uh, once my daughter gets home, um, I may, uh, cut the stream for a little bit, let my champions refresh, and then probably come back. Uh, so we probably go for probably close to another hour, and then I'll probably, uh, take a, uh, break, get her in the door and situated. And then uh, come back. All right, let's see if he's immune to incinerate. He is not. There we go. Uh, I'm in Georgia. Uh, down here uh, about 45 minutes. Um, west of Atlanta. I had to think about it for a minute. About 45 minutes west of Atlanta. I think I asked you before where you was, but I don't remember uh, where you was. But I think you're a couple of states away from me. Uh, cosmic Truth, or uh, Truth Cosmic, uh, is on a uh, work trip, and he's about an hour from me where he's working at for the rest of the month. So I may try to see if I can hook up with him before he uh, finishes uh, being in town for a little bit.
That's all right. Keep being passive. There we go. Yeah, I thought I was a little ways from you. I don't remember where you're at, but uh, I thought we was a little ways away from each other. Yeah, my OCD <laughs> won't let me quit hitting the help button. We got 14 likes already on the stream. Let's go. So, uh, what was your take on the uh, final boss, uh, Minnow, on the uh, 8.4? Was it any better than uh, Serasti's? About the same. A little more challenging. Yo, how's it going? Is that Wolf? That is a Wolf Pack. What's going on, Wolf Pack? <laughs> How are you, brother? Oh, uh, you know me. Fighting to hang in there. Hanging in there like a hair in a biscuit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we are finally to, uh, taking the challenge <laughs> to grind for a champion. Figured this would yeah, be a um, decent champion to grind for. No, it's definitely a champion worth grinding for, but it's you're going to regret your life. <laughs> Why is that? Do you not remember how nasty my werewolf by night uh, grind was? Uh, I know that you didn't get him, but I don't remember how many points you put up for him either. Millions. I can't even remember how many, but three days straight of grinding, like, oh man, it's, it'll take a toll on you. Because it's three times a day, every day for three days, if you're going to get him. Well, I'm hoping that it's going to be a lot lower with 8.4 coming out. There might be a chance of it. I, I, you got I'll give brand you that. brand new battleground seasons eight point four just come out. So with I don't know, I guess it's like a perfect storm, if you will. No, I mean I, I, I'll, I'll I'll give you that. It does give you a pretty good chance of it, but the thing about it is, is a lot of the people uh, that are eight point four or battlegrounds type of people have already given up on arena a while ago yeah i could see that so what is your prediction for prowler um we've had some in the alliance uh speculate uh about 80 million being the cutoff honestly considering how good he looks and the fact that he is the guaranteed uh prowless killer I mean, I personally think he's a better champion than Spider Punk by far. And from what I've seen, um, I think Spider Punk will be good because of his new mechanic, which will take some people getting used to. But I honestly would not be surprised if you're looking at 110, 115. Yeah, we had some speculating about 80 million. So my goal was going to be 100. And we're a little ways from it. Oh yeah, it takes it takes a lot more than it seems, even with having a decent amount of seven stars. Ouch! I think I'm going to at least try and get through enough to grab the three and the four star. Yeah, I got that already. Oh, yeah, that's, <laughs> that's easy enough to do. I got the milestones aren't bad. It, it's once you actually start trying to go for the champs, 
And, and I, you know, honestly, it's going to be one of those things that once they finally do a seven star arena, which I'm surprised we do, we haven't had one yet. Right. Um, I, uh, that will bring scores down for a bit because nobody's going to care about the six stars. It, it, well, at least not, you know, the people that can actually grind properly are, and, you know, who cares about going for six star Prowler when you can go for seven star? Yeah. That at makes that sense. Point, at that point, it'll be worth grinding for a six star champion. I forgot to reactivate boost to help. So we've You'll been do going that a lot. We've been going for a minute. <laughs> we managed to uh, come up with 143,000 battle chips. So that's that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's always one of the nice things about doing one of these. Is not only does it add a decent amount of units, but those battle chips give a good chance for some more. Especially I... if you're smart about it and don't get the bigger arena crystals. Yeah, that's where I fell short. I usually get the uncollected ones just because I have more to pop. But I heard that the big ones hit better when they do hit. They hit better when they hit, but the problem is is that you're spending so much of your battle chips, and so it like you have such a low percentage of being able to hit. So you're you're it's like okay, I can I can buy a hundred dollar lot, a hundred dollar scratch off, and yeah, it's going to pay off a lot more than a dollar scratch off. But if I bought a hundred dollar scratch offs, yeah, I got a better chance of paying off than that one chance gives me. That's true. And unfortunately, what a lot of us tend to forget is, you know. This game was con was nicknamed Marvel Casino of Champions for a reason. Yep. Casino is definitely right. So we've been grinding for an hour now. Uh, I think I see. think if I remember right and I'd have to go look, but I, if I remember right, every one of my streams over the Werewolf by Night uh, three days, they were all three-hour streams. So it was like nine, uh, 27 hours in three days worth of grinding. Gotcha. We started at 35 million on this grind. And, Yo, uh, Cisco, how's it going? What's up, brother Wolf? Um, we started the stream at thirty-five million. We're at forty-one, so that's uh, about six million an hour. And we okay. had our good champions uh, refreshed, and I had boost on. Yeah, I mean the nice thing too is I don't I don't know how thick your six star roster is, but I know like with mine, there's only like thirty some six stars I don't have in the whole game, so you can actually get quite a ways between your seven and your six stars towards having your champions refresh before you even get through the full roster. Oh, come on, Silk Surfer. Um, my six star roster is pretty thick. Uh, I don't know. Uh, Mino, you know, how's it going, my man? Hello, person that I don't know how to pronounce your <laughs> your name. Uh, welcome in. Hope you are doing well. Appreciate the support. And if you have something that would be easy for me to identify you with in chat, feel free to drop what you would like for us to call you. No problem, Rizzo. I was wondering because I knew I saw you on call all when I started watching the stream and 
I, I had another call I was waiting on to come in that I had to take care of beforehand. I also saw Minos think that Rizzo was me at first. Uh, yeah, I think Rizzo had to take a phone call as well. I'm just, oh, I got some videos I got to work on tonight, so I decided, uh, videos and applications, so I decided to take tonight off from streaming, but when I saw you were going to, you know, commit insanity, I might yeah. as well come over here and uh, try and give you some counseling. Counseling? <laughs> By the time you get done with a, a, a uh, champion grind in the... Uh, Arena, uh, arena, you, you you will understand the definition of insanity, and you will need counseling. <laughs> well, let's see. In Japanese. My name is. Oh, I'll read that in just a minute. <laughs> Kenshi. Hmm. Kenshi. Gotcha. Um, uh, if you don't mind me asking, did you find the channel through the uh, TikToks that I've been posting with my daughter? Boom, there we go. Uh, we appreciate you coming in. Uh, I gotta quit paying attention to chat while the fight's going on, even though it's arena. Nah, no, yeah. <laughs> when you get and see, I'm, it seems like I'm not it, it seems like, oh, arena. It's so simple. You don't have to pay attention. You can you can just kind of grind and just kind of do your thing. Nah, arena's all, like you don't have to worry about nodes. You don't have to worry about a lot of that stuff. But yeah, you can easily slip up an arena fight just as easily as anything else. Yeah, I'm definitely right. not Dementia. And I'm uh, not uh, Brian Grant either. <laughs> Brian doesn't even keep up with Chad. <laughs> I love the man to death, but it, and uh, rightfully so. I mean, when you got 300 messages going by every five he, minutes. Well, he you, plays uh, Reno with one hand. Yeah, I don't know how he does that. He's He's able to play Arena. And check Twitter or X or whatever you want to call it now, and uh, read <laughs> messages. Yeah, read messages. No, I'd love to figure out how. Like, I'd love to figure out how to get good. First off, I ain't good enough to play this game with two hands, let alone one. But I, especially like when I'm when I go to donate and stuff, like. I ought to run stuff because I only got one hand to play with, so ain't no way I'm that's true brain in anything. By the way, um I dropped something in your Discord yesterday and if it's not okay, please say so. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. By all means. And um, if you would like to drop that link in the chat, uh, you are welcome to. And I got to turn down the game, opportunity right now, to be honest with you, with everything I got going on. Come on. I'm going to die. Oh, so close. 2%. Stupid bishop. Jakey, what's going on, man? Yes, that is Wolf on Call. Rizzo will be back here in just a minute. Uh, according, hey, Jakey, how's it going? According to Wolf, uh, me and Rizzo are committing insanity at the same time. <laughs> uh, Rizzo made up his mind that he was going to grind for uh, Prowler first. Uh, yeah, I, I, that honestly, it, it is a good way to do it. If you're going to do it, be you know, have a couple people that you're grinding with at the same time that, you know, BD and I both went for werewolf by night at that same weekend. Uh, and it was nice. Just, you know, mind you, he grinds for back then he grinded like 
it was a job. Yep. So, um, you know, but it is nice to be able to, you know, kind of benchmark yourself against somebody. Yeah, and right now I'm falling behind, according to Rizzo. <laughs> I asked Rizzo earlier how many points he had, and uh, he gave me a number, and uh, I was like two million behind him. I was like, "Oh, dude, I'm right behind you." He was already ten million above what he told me when he sent it, <laughs> and didn't even tell me. Then when he gets on call a minute ago, he's like, oh, yeah, by the way, I've already got 50 million. I was like, 50 million? He said, yeah, I had like such and such million when you asked me earlier. I was like, oh, that's I'm wrong. Trying, I'm trying to remember because um, I, I, I haven't like kept track of it lately, but um, I think I can do close to 20 just off my seven stars alone. Is it Nathan? How's it going? And hi back at you. Um, be honest with you, I don't know what uh, I can do with my seven stars. Uh, seven star roster is okay. Uh, it's better than a lot, but not as good as some. I got a couple of rank twos. I got one rank three. Need that second one for Valiant. I've got five rank twos, one rank three. Um, I just, I just had an amazing opening a couple of days ago that duped two of my seven stars that I'm very happy with. Uh, is the video already out? Yeah. Who'd you dupe? For a few days. Uh, I duped Null and Black Cat in the same opening. Oh, those are good. I may be overestimating how much I can do with my seven stars, to be honest with you. Like I said, I I ain't been keeping track because mostly I I go into arena when like arena wins are on or if I'm grinding for units because I'm trying to get uh, content done, um, which I am right now, obviously. Um, I just got done with... I For the first time in over eight years almost nine years of playing this game um i actually left myself in a piece of content for three days oh wow yeah i've never done that before in all the time i played this game if if i couldn't get it done you know if i ran out of potions and revives you know, obviously, if it was one of those things where, you know, hey, I'll go grab a couple hundred units real quick and I can I can finish this fight off, whatever. But uh, also, Kenny uh, G, thank you for the new subscribe. That is very much appreciated, my friend, and hope you are doing well from Ch Jap Japan. Japan, yes. Uh Jakey, to answer your question, it was nasty. I hated him, and uh, your advice was crap. But um, that's because you're better. Well, that's better. Uh, apparently, you are a lot better with CGR than I am. <laughs> and I really should have brought in Hawkwing instead. <laughs> your advice was crap. <laughs> 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 that's hilarious. I was getting I was getting ready to go into 8.3 and and Jakey sends this message in our uh, alliance chat and he's like oh well if you're gonna love it because CGR will cake uh, will easily take him and I'm like okay like CGR is my top champion on my ch uh, on my uh, account like well, let's go you're gonna give me advice like that I ain't even gonna hesitate then I started looking at videos while I was about 20% through him and getting my ass whooped. Yeah, if you remember, I took Adam Warlock for Serastis. Yeah, and yeah. And Minnow come on and said, that's like the worst champ you could have brought. But yet I watched Rizzo solo it uh, with Adam Warlock. Oh, yeah, it's one of those things. Like, I know plenty of people, including Jakey, who, who walked through it with cgr but the key to him um which i realized as i was doing it 
um, you know, because I'm checking videos in the process and everything, is you need a champion that has a ton of buffs because the buffs allow you to ignore the shields and do more damage based off the amount of buffs you have. Ah. Um, of course, neither one of us knew this when I was talking to you when you did your run. Yep. And <laughs> CGR is great for that fight. Yeah, see, man, I'm, so I, I, I'm sure like you probably walked through it with him just like Jakey did. <laughs> Should be great for it. I saw some people do it with him with only rank four, like having a hundred k mediums. I it, the problem is, is I, every time I would get all three shields down, just at that point, I in order to get the third shield down, I'd accidentally screw up and push him to that SP three, and he wrecked me. And. I needed to punch, I needed to ignore the shields to a point. And Hulkling would have been a lot better for it, but I'm mostly just picking on you, Jakey. I, I appreciate the advice, and, and if I was better at this game, I, CGR, I can see how he would have wrecked him. CGR is a, a, like, yeah, he, he's, I understand why um, Slayer is so high on CGR. So, uh, how many revives did it take? Um, like 60. Oh, wow. Yeah. No, I'm going to try Hulkling first. I, I think, uh, like, I understand the just hurt it, but I try not to just hurt it. Like, it was so bad. Uh, first off, I forgot to record the end of the fight. Um, and then I was so excited when I finally did it. Um, I, delayed my, I delayed my crystal opening video so that I could add in the rewards from finishing it. And I forgot to hit record again. <laughs> so... Um, the actual dupe on Black Cat, it, there's other than the fact of me like showing off that she is now awakened. Um, yeah, there's no actual video footage of it. Sure, Bonds, how you doing, man? Appreciate you coming in. And what was uh, the stressful BG's fight? And how do you like the new Battlegrounds meta? Because I haven't started, because I have been grinding this uh, arena. trying to give Rizzo a chance to uh, get ahead of me in Battlegrounds so that he doesn't think that it's an unfair advantage. But apparently he's part, grinding them too. Part of it too is I know like I, I, and I'm, I'm sure this is a factor my mental state has not been great lately and one thing that I will tell everybody in this game if you, you haven't figured it out yet um, if you are in a bad mental place this game is, it will reflect in your gameplay. Well, it reflects in my gameplay, and I think I'm doing all right. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, by the way, I was talking to Awesome last night, and he said I'm he sorry. finally got done with, uh, physical therapy yes yes so he's... happy to hear that for all of you yep he just got released from therapy and uh just got to get him uh his endurance back up on the job nice uh yusuf is a great guy so did he say he went against yusufa uh, well, I was defending our rep as an alliance against four Loki, LOL. Yusafa had nine freaking rank threes. I won against him, but he had a SIG 200 domino. It's nasty. Yeah. Oh, that's a bad. Yeah, going up against four Loki, like, I don't care who you match up against in four Loki. You're going to have a battle. Prowler is worth the grind. Speaking of Prowler, I just picked up the three star. So I should stop trying to do arena and reach out at the same time. Ah, uh, so you saw a band 
Prowler as well. <laughs> of course he did. Um, first off, um, Prowler, yeah, I mean, he, off of everything that I saw, um, first off, off the, the uh, Karate Mike preview videos, um, like, he, you know, Karate Mike is always going to make him look phenomenal. <laughs> Ten times he better is, than he is. First off, you know, uh, you know that's that's his job. Yeah. To make the, <laughs> but also on top of that too, you know, it's not like he's going in with uh, an unleveled champion. He's going in with a maxed out everything. Because you know, when you when you in that C in the CCP and. Um, can access that beta server where you've got access to, you know, instantly rank it or something up to play with it properly. But, but just from the abilities and stuff that I've read up on a prowler, like he shuts down so much. Well, I haven't seen a deep dive on him or anything. I just uh, heard of the hype, I guess, around the Alliance and uh, some of the chats. He is the first champion in the game that can 100% shut down um, Destroyer. Falter. No, he can shut down Falter. Any champion that has Oh, Falter, Falter that's what it was. And the other thing about it is, is not only does he shut it down, but he also can inflict it. No. He's a two-way killer. Oh yeah, he's sick on defense and offense. Like you, he's he's gonna uh, upset people as much as Bullseye does. All right, I can't stand fighting Mordo. Uh, you know, the thing about it is, is I've always loved fighting Mordo, but the thing, uh, the what made me love fighting Mordo, I don't get the opportunity to do anymore. Um, Lou, uh, apparently you were timed out for half an hour, but you're back now. I'm not quite for sure why you were, but I saw it happen. Uh, Hurt can shut down Falter 100%. I am not gotten oh, him yeah. to do that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Hercules spam special once, get the true sense, and it bypasses Falter. Yeah. From what I understand with uh, Prowler, though, you don't have to do anything. It just instantly shuts right. down. Right. Welcome Ooh, nice, back. Uh, <laughs> nice to see you back and everything, and hi to you as well. Loving the beard. Hey, I appreciate it. We grow it all hey, year you. long. We shave it off once a year on Christmas Eve. It has grown back quite nicely. Oh yeah, it's getting it's it's on the on the grow now. Once it gets to a certain point, it just takes off. Yeah, we um again, I don't I don't know why I I didn't see anything inappropriate out of you. Um but boom, apparently boom. stinky felt you should be. So boom boom. Come on. Let's go. Oh, I I gotta send you something later. I got it. Mm. Um, so I was tar. I I jumped on. I showed. I showed. I think I showed you the uh, thumbnail that uh, Abdo is using for the meetup here in Seattle. Uh, seems like I remember it. Um, where uh, Abdo's Hawk, I'm Wolverine. Um, oh my God! 
Panda Man is Iron Man. Man. Um, but yeah, the five of us are all Marvel characters. Hmm. Nikki says I'm rude in all chats. Lou, I. Um. Everybody's got their own opinions. Do you know what I get like? that you kind of that you get opinionated about how people should play the game. It doesn't bother me in any way, shape, or form. Uh, who's going to the meetup? Um, well, right now, as far as YouTubers that are going to be at the meetup, there will definitely be myself, uh, Ab- uh, Abdo, the Intoxicator Gamer, um, Panda Man Pete, Royal, and Akbar. Um, as far as who else is going that are non-YouTubers, uh, we're still trying to get a head count on that. If anybody is going to be in the Seattle area and is interested in coming out to the meetup at the end of the month, uh, there is a Discord server specifically for that. Feel free to get a hold of me and I can get you that link. Sorry, I'm back. Sorry, my daughter came in for a uh, minute. I saw her. Oh, so Tariff, I think this is the first time I've seen you in the chat. Appreciate you coming in. Loving the beard. Uh, Let's see. Do I use lotion? Uh, Yes, I do leave-in conditioner and beard oil uh, as well, uh, along with uh, putting conditioner in it uh, while I'm taking a shower and letting it sit the whole time. Uh, Crash. Kratos is that Kratos is that how you Kratos. say that Kratos from uh God of War okay never seen God of War hopefully that's a good reference it is it's a okay. phenomenal reference nay I'll take it then I will take it uh yeah, they, he's and, the main character from the game and he defeats all of the Greek gods got it okay uh so if you are just joining the channel I don't remember seeing this uh, tariff's name and uh, Kang Kangji uh, is new as well. Uh, I grow my beard out all year long, and then at Christmas time I play Santa Claus. So uh, I'll dress up like Santa Claus during Christmas time when I have uh, time. Oh, he goes unstoppable too. Oh yeah, Dragon Man. Like he's he's easy to defeat, but he's also easy to slip up against. Jesus, absolutely, I'm having fun. Um, I'm grinding my life away. Jake, Jakey, I have it. I have him at rank four myself. Cisco just tries to trigger me. Is that wolf right here? Yes, that is what we'll call. He says I'm going to need canceling after I get done with this arena grind. <laughs> canceling? Yeah. <laughs> Cancel culture is going to get you, buddy. Counseling. In other words, I'm going to need a therapist. I thought you said canceling. Uh, therapy. <laughs> what's up? Boy? Therapy and not the physical kind. Awesome Pass says, what's up? Not much, man. Good to hear you. He said it's uh, rotten of you to come down here and mess with me. Okay. <laughs> <We're coming laughs> <here>. <laughs> He'll laughing. never believe you. Wolf's laughing because <laughs> it's not true. <laughs> he said it's good to hear you, awesome path. Good to hear him too. How many points are you aiming for? He, currently, he, his goal is a hundred million. I think he's going to fall short at a hundred million, but I wish him luck if he it, it, that he won't. I'm hoping his current theory that everybody is too busy to uh, put up enough points is true. Because it sucks to do all this work to get the five star. 
Well, if I don't, then uh, I have battle chips that can turn into gold and uh, units. Which are both always needed. And the even if I miss out on the six star, the rank reward should be an, uh, a decent, you know, alternative. Oh, it helps. It does. Like I said, the the uh, the battle chips and the gold. Like I was telling some of my alliance mates the other day, um, this game is a great metaphor for life. Um, you know, in this game, you need three things: gold, ISO, and um, catalysts. And you often have two out of the three, and you're you're normally short one or the other. Uh, one of uh, one of the three and in life to uh, truly enjoy things you need time money and energy and if you got money and energy you probably ain't got no time let's see uh i don't know about you but i need iso for rank uh so iso and gold is not my uh bottleneck right now for the first time in forever. Uh, uh, let me guess. Catalysts are. Uh, yes, catalysts are my kryptonite <laughs> right now. Like All I right, said. Boys, I'm about to uh, go ahead and bounce off of here. My full family's here. <laughs> and they're, yeah, they're going to drive me crazy. No, you're good, Rizzo. Hope you feel better too, buddy. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Wolf. Uh, sorry to make it so short, but good to see you, buddy. Not a problem. If you get a chance uh, not to take away from family time in any way, shape, or form, please do not do so. But I do actually have a question for you when you get a moment. Oh, yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. You can ask me now. Okay. Give me that. Uh, nope. Sorry. Um, my, my son. <laughs> I actually uh, got a uh, former Alliance member of you that just reached, uh, of yours, that just reached out to me. And, um, to see is if it, I maybe had a spot for him. Is it a curé? Uh, no, I've, I've he's been running with me for a little while. Um, it's Fluffy. Fluffy, he was in our alliance. I don't remember Fluffy being in our alliance. Uh, give me a second. I'll pull up his in-game name real quick because it's different than his. Uh, <clears throat> oh no, it is curé. Sorry. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah, I actually recommended him to uh, to go to your alliance. Um, okay. Yeah, we're we're just pushing, and I think he needs a uh, probably like a slower slower pace, but he's very wow. active. Okay. <laughs> he's very active. He it was just honestly the way he was talking. You know, I, I he he kind of sounded like he was like he was kind of semi active. And, no, he's, I mean. He's, He's actually very active. He just, uh, you know, we just looking for, you know, we're looking for a little bit more skilled, I guess, to try to say it nice, I guess. I don't know. It's no, kind of I, no I, I get that. We're, we're definitely stepping things up, too. And I'm, I'm willing to take a risk to help somebody grow. Right. But I also am, I, I, I kind of have concerns about somebody that's like, well, you know, I try to be active when I can be. Bro, I, I, I like, well, what there was a guy, point in time that focus? I had time for that. Um, what is your guy's focus? AQ. AQ okay. is, our, is our top priority. Okay. Um, I think he'll be all right. Okay. Yeah, we're not we're not a big war alliance the way you guys are. I mean, we're definitely looking to step up. We finished gold four this season, which is lower than I want to see us. But I'm not really caring. Like, if we get up to gold one, I'd be extremely happy. No, I I think he can handle AQ. What maps are you guys running? Uh, right now we're running seven seven five, but I want to get us to the point where we're doing eight seven uh, eight seven six. <laughs> okay. No, yeah, he should. I I think he. Our focus right now is war. Yeah, and yeah, uh, I knew that. Yeah, and and uh, we're pushing, trying to push plat, and yeah, um, which takes some hardcore dedication. I understand. It, it that. does. It does, and and I, you know, I don't know if people are going to stick around because some of our members, you know, kind of weren't expecting that. But um, 
I mean, he communicates well. Matter of fact, that was one of my biggest things is he's gotten a lot better with his communication. I can literally reach out to him and be like, hey, man, we got about an hour left in war. I need you to jump in and go down this path. And he's he's like, OK, you know, like I've never. Yeah, see, I, I, I've gotten that out of Breeze and it's been absolutely wonderful. And I, I appreciate you sending him over to me. That's part of the reason why I wanted to ask. Yeah, Breeze and Kure are probably about the same. OK. About as far as communication and skill and everything, I would probably put them on the same same level, basically. That's awesome. I, that that gives me a little bit more to work with when I talk yeah. to my officers. And, and, yeah. yeah, I don't know why Kure was saying what he was saying about himself, but um, as a matter of fact, I was vouching for him to stay for the longest be, because his communicate. Matter of fact, he com he communicated with me better than Breeze did. <clears throat> Okay. I mean, I, I, that, that says a lot right there to me, because like I said, Breeze has been absolutely wonderful. As a matter of fact, this last week, because of uh, all the stuff going on in my personal life, I asked Breeze to cover my path in AQ so that I could go do one of the lower groups, um, you know, just because I'm, I'm making mental mistakes right now that are costing me, and I, I've already spent a ton on just getting through 8.3, and I ain't got the resources right now to, to drop on IQ, and I didn't want to cost anybody tickets. So I said, you know, hey, can you cover me for this week? And, and Bree stepped oh, up. And, okay, King. Chill, chill. That's my son. I'm, I'm sorry. No, no, no. No no apologies needed, bro. Like I said, I just, I, I trust you. We, well, you know, we've been communicating well for the last no. year while no. we've been doing YouTube together and stuff. So... And when I could get a chance to get your opinion on things, I, I kind of want—I kind of wanted to do so because I, I definitely value your opinion. Yeah, no, I I tried to keep Cure as long as I could because he stepped up his communication. Um, cool. You won't be disappointed. I, yeah, no, I I I'm not the leader in my alliance no more. So the the changes are coming. Um. Had I still been the leader, I would have been fine with Cure being in our alliance mm -hmm. um, because he, he, when I reach out to him, he answers the call. So, okay, he, that... he, just, he just struggled in war, and that's what yeah, we're no, so. yeah. No, I I have a uh, I have a philosophy that like yeah, I need you to be active in this stuff. But honestly, as long as you communicate with me, so that I know when something's coming up or. You know, I know if I need you in a moment, unless you've told me that you're not going to be available, I know I can I can hit you up. That means a lot to me as an alliance leader. Yeah, no, nah, Kure's he's uh, yeah, he, he for me personally because we were in the same battle group. He was he was really really reliable for me. Awesome. And and on that note, I'm I am going to jump. Yeah, off no, go this go take care of man. Appreciate you, Rizzo. He doesn't care, this guy. <laughs> of course not. <laughs> Good luck on your grind, Rizzo. All right, guys. I will talk Great to you Great night, later. brother. Good night. Yeah, I figured I'd ask you after call uh, after chat yeah. as well. I need yeah, it, 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 it'd be worth it. He's He's a good player. But, you know, when Breeze vouched for him and stuff, like, it, that that carried a lot of weight at first. But then I started talking to him, and he's like, well, you know, I try and be active when I can be. But, and I know, like, especially after coming out of you guys' alliance, I've talked to Breeze a bit about you guys' alliance and stuff. And I get what you guys are doing compared to what we, we're doing. We're not a war-focused alliance. And war takes a lot more than AQ does by far, even even when you're doing map seven and eight. Like, war takes mm -hmm. more than... AQ. Well, we don't push AQ. We boss rush AQ. We I know do. you guys do. We I, do. Which... Um, there we go. Uh, uh, woo. I actually just got a call back yesterday for a second interview on one of the jobs. It's the first job that's actually called me back for a second interview. Oh, that's awesome. Um, it, it, the the thing about it is is the second interview is on the 18th and the day i have to uh get some uh, get this last month that i missed of rent to my landlords is the 20th so i won't have a check in time which is why i did put um the gofundme out there 
in spite of the fact that I was pretty hesitant to do so. Um, but if anybody wants to help me get by until I can get back to work, um, I said it very clearly in the GoFundMe, um, even if people would like me to pay them back, um, as soon as I'm back on my feet, I will pay back anybody that wants to help. Um, I know I've asked a lot out of the community lately and I feel horrible doing so, but I need the lifeline at the moment. So what is uh, the magic number of what you need to uh, make it work so that you can at least uh, have another month? Uh, right now, with what I owe and the fact that right at the time that I'm going to owe it, it's uh, also going to put me owing the next month's rent as well. Uh -huh. um, I set a goal on the GoFundMe of five grand, which makes me absolutely disgusted to ask for. Okay. But that would make sure that I got, and that, that buys me enough time to get checks, uh, get several checks under my belt and guarantee that I'm not just any up right back where where I'm at in the process of, you know, getting there. Apparently Perry don't want to work for me. I've been having some issues with it myself lately. A uh, few more minutes left on that. But I also do know that uh, Kabam has been doing a lot of behind-the-scenes updates um, because the uh, whole mastery loadouts thing didn't go the way they were trying to get it to work. So we all know every time Kabam fixes something, they break three other things. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh woo if you know where i can sell a kidney uh message me privately <laughs> i might be willing um i believe it's a thing uh, uh it, <laughs> where you can uh donate something else uh, that's very personable. Uh, there, I do know that there are men's clinics that I have heard of over the years that do pay certain amounts. Um, but uh, I have never, uh, it's always been one of those rumors that I hear about, but I've never actually heard anybody actually do it outside of uh, watching, you know, some comedy show or somebody did it. Um, you can Google it, it's there. Okay. And if you uh, don't have a need for that, uh, <laughs> I'm trying to keep it YouTube friendly. Are we talking? Are we talking the? Are we talking Chum Bucket or are we talking uh, Manly Rotations? Um, we're talking about. I like to play in baseball in high school. <laughs> gotcha. Gotcha. Yeah, no, I, I, I get what I get what you're saying. Uh, I guess that's the best way to put it. <laughs> no, I've heard I've heard there's a few different things that you can actually technically Why does it keep telling me that I have a new profile picture? Oh, uh, It could be profitable. The question is, is it, can it be profitable in under eight days? Um, I think the answer could be yes. I'll do some research tonight after I get done hanging out with you. Um, the awesome this path does, found this a... This uh, does Frank and Beans. Do what? Cisco says Franken beans, and I, I, I'm more so asking if we're talking about the beans.
guys, I do want to point this out as we're trying to do euthanisms uh, here and stuff. Um, in spite of the fact that the man does work in a blue collar trade, he is also a pastor. Um, so <laughs> Jesus, Murdoch is a pain. <laughs> it's because you're fighting with five stars. <laughs> Oh, and on top of that, too, uh, Stealth Spidey is not necessarily the counter. No. By any means. No. I mean, there are so much better counters for Modoc than Stealthy. Oh. I mean, I'm more than willing to set on an ice pack for uh, a week or two on lives if it means that I can pay the bills. Um, it's worth looking into. I will do what I can. Oh. Um, the Awesome Path came across a, uh, a, uh, article. And yeah. if it was true, uh, I would have already been done it. Yeah, I've heard about some of those type of things. But, like I said, it, but it, I couldn't every... find the deal that he found because the deal he found was like, I mean, it was like stupid money, like a hundred thousand per uh, marble. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I, heard, I read one uh, like two or three years ago that I almost did at that point in time that was like twenty or thirty thousand. Um, definitely a conversation I didn't think we would have on stream tonight. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing the conversations that you end up having on stream that you don't like. Uh, Didi was live the other night, and I knew this doesn't compare in any way, shape, or form. But we're sitting there; he's grinding out things on stream, and we ended up like getting distracted on stream and talking about classic video games for the entire stream. Like we were talking about super Nintendo and regular Nintendo games. And that's not even like, and even this isn't even the most like, okay, we're pushing boundaries here. Conversation I've ever had on a stream. 100%. By the way, Cisco, since you're in chat and I haven't actually said anything to you in the Alliance, did you notice that your uh, split personality has been uh, rectified? Yeah, split personality. So uh, back in the days of one of, one of my early alliances, um, Cisco acquired a second account uh -huh. and I uh, got fairly active with it for a while. And then um, when we got hit with a couple um, times that we lost members in this alliance, he's like, well, I can go ahead and bring in my second so that we got a few more people and we can get things going. And I've been promising him for probably uh, five, six months as soon as I can, man, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get it out of there so you can focus on just the main account. I ain't gonna call you up and be like, I need you to cover this or I need you to cover that. And he's, you know, I've been I told him, in spite of the fact that I have a couple members that I uh, need to take care of, um, that I would make sure that his next one, um his the next new member would would allow his him to go down to a single account gotcha um gotcha so. yeah Ooh. we're gonna have a bunch of class disadvantage on this one here's what it is though um it seems illegal in the u.s but you can still ask yeah that's what i um, from what I, that's the other thing that I have read repeatedly, any kind of organ donation, I don't care what it is, um, for profit is technically illegal in the United States. There are people that get around it, 
um, but it's a higher risk, and uh, I don't have a lot of luck on taking risk with elite. Nope. <laughs> We would like to know how long you're planning on grinding. I uh, do not have a plan. I'm just here. <laughs> Until he gets tired or the wife catches him. Whichever one happens first. Uh, wife should be in the bed. She's uh, <laughs> very well medicated. Well, for you, it ain't profit. It's an escape of debt. Yeah, but unfortunately, the uh, U.S. government doesn't see it that way. I can never time Quicksilver's special into a combo and be successful. I have a hard time comboing in or uh, out of a, a special or into a special myself um you know there are definitely champions that i do well with it on but consistently across the board with every champion eh. yeah my daughter's here and uh she's uh inside settled so i guess I uh, plan on going until my champions are not worth uh, bringing in anymore and need to be refreshed. Yeah, um, Wu, I can. I, if you want me to ever sit down and tell you all the reason, you know, I'm not saying that the United States is the worst country in the world, but there are a lot of things that we are way behind the rest of the world on. And we don't take care of our people nearly as much as people believe that we do. All right, so we're just over 10 million points in about two hours. Nice. We started the stream at 35 million, and I think we're at 46 million now. Got a little bit more to catch up with what Rizzo said he had. Oh, you didn't do just your six stars, and uh, you didn't go seven stars, six stars, and then get into your fives. You're, you still got six stars coming up. I uh, I would honestly filter just I'd filter out all your five uh, just to your six stars. Run through them first, um, because your five stars aren't worth nearly as many points. Yeah, because I got to my five win streak, I'm just running them as they come and not even thinking about it. I mean, I get it. You know, honestly, if you're doing, you know, with it being your first grind and you're just doing whatever you can, like, I understand, but uh, if you do, if you ever decide that you want to consistently try and keep up with champs, which I I know is impossible with your life. Oh yeah. Um, but uh, um, uh, are you uh, are you running uh, recoils? Yes, I am. Okay. Yeah, I was uh, instructed last night by my alliance that it was a very good idea to run suicides while grinding the arena, so I did put them on for this. Westy, what's going on? This better be a moist one, man. It's never dry over here, brother. Never dry. You are in the right place if you're looking for things to be moist. <laughs> Uh, do me a favor for your own sake. Uh, whenever you refer to those, ouchies or recoil. Oh, 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 yep. Sorry. No, 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 I get it. I have to train myself very well. And that is YouTube true. doesn't like that word. Got it. Well, we're a little ways from being monetized, so hopefully it'll be... Uh... Okay. <laughs> How are your watch hours doing? I've been trying to help you out. Uh, halfway there. Nice. 
Yeah, like I said, anytime, and especially now that, like, donating used to take me an hour and 45 minutes, two hours that I was gone out of the house to do it. But now that I'm having to use public transportation to do it, like, it's more like four or five hours that I'm out of the house just to go donate. So I've been, I've been rotating through your live streams. Well, I appreciate that. Westy about to head to bed, saw you was live, and had to say, well, I'm glad you did, man. Much appreciated. Uh, glad you came in to say hello. Hope you get some rest. I should be in the bed myself. It's almost midnight here, but I'm still on East Coast time. I, I think it's East Coast. Wherever Las Vegas is. Are you kidding me? What's up? Oh, I my video went live three hours ago, the one I dropped tonight, and Discord just sent out the notification from my server that I put up a video. Change your time out from 30 minutes to three. You just lost 45 minutes from me. Uh, that's... I think it still counts if you were still watching. You yeah, if you were chat. still watching, it does. Yeah, it doesn't matter if you're if you're chatting or not. No, I'm just kind of curious. All right, so I took your advice, and I'm just doing my six and seven stars now. My five stars are no longer in the deck. So did you see the announcement today from Kabam that the uh, three switching of masteries is uh, now extended all the way to May 1st? Um... No, I have not. Mind you, the problem that they probably <laughs> fixed obviously isn't because I just tested it for the first time today and it still is triggering the same thing. That if I can't talk, I can't survive. <laughs> <laughs> I have an LOL I left. <laughs> Ah, uh, thank you for the blue last uh, one stop streaming after he made me mo uh, moderator. Legacy 2099, how's it going? What's up, Legacy? How in the world are you? I was actually talking to Legacy last night. And got informed that the first video they dropped was when they were eight years old. And you're welcome, Woo. Hey, looky, I got a three star. I can level up for level up. Boom, oh, there we go. That was a nice one. Here with Ember. Is Ember somebody we know? Uh, not familiar to me, but I bring everybody you want to bring. Uh, I need to be the narrator of the narrator. <laughs> okay, so... One more win, and we will tie our all-time high win streak in the arena. So, we got to win this one. And we will tie our all-time high win streak, and then we will be setting new win streaks. I have a hard time beating my all-time win streak, but that's mostly because uh, I used to actually live in the arena back in early days of the game.
back when Arena wasn't as uh, evil of a word as people make it these days. I was actually eight and a half. Yeah, I know you said eight and a half last night, but... <laughs> And I know at your age that half is extremely important. <laughs> well, we appreciate you stopping in and uh, showing the support. I'm watching in bed with at the phone under the covers. I need to be. Do in not bed, get yourself but... in trouble. At least it's not a school night. Um, that's weird. Yeah, that's what I that's what I said. At least it's not a school night. So <laughs> my computer's trying to push a uh, Windows update in the middle of the stream. Oh, isn't that lovely? Excuse so, me, I'm on this. So, what's your highest win streak? There's no highest win streak at this point. Um, oh, come on. That was a dex. Four hundred and forty-four. Four hundred and seventy-four. Sorry. Oh, that's a big one. Yeah. Yeah, mine is 191. So that tells you how much uh, of the arena I grind. Stream Elements is not a real person. Stream Elements is the software all of us use. Or one of the softwares we all use. Uh, it, I set up Stream Elements to get some notifications. Those notifications don't really work. It's supposed to go off when we have a new subscriber and uh, everything, but it, it it doesn't work. But somehow it has managed to keep this little uh, I... chat popping, and I can't figure out how to even disconnect it from the uh, channel. Okay, so my, um, my, like, I haven't gotten the bots to work, but all my notifications work just fine. I can teach you how to get the notifications to work. Like, I know you've been on my stream when, like, it howls and announces a donation or anything like that. Yes. So, I can teach you how to do that, bro. That's not a problem. I taught Dee, Dee how to do those. I'm actually the reason Dee, Dee switched from Stream Labs to Stream Elements. Elements for his notifications. Woo, you got 1,200 win streak. Almost, from what he said. That is, surprise me. Some that is insane. Grinders. That is insane. I could not imagine grinding 1,200 on a Daga Marina. I'm already going insane at 191. <laughs> Curious. I'm actually going to look up somebody that I expect to have a high win streak. If I can actually find them because I don't remember. Yeah, you're going to find out I'm not a ghost player either. I love ghosts. I, it took me a long time to get to a point that I love ghosts. I'm not a ghost or a quake. See, and actually we were talking about it before I got distracted, but that's the reason I got to the point of loving to fight Mordo, because Quake cheeses the crap out of Mordo. I can see that. She was my go-to Mordo counter for so long.
I gotta make some rank up decisions tonight, but I'm kind of waiting to see if I can get uh, get a actual like particular. So you working class on rank exploration up. next of uh, eight three? Uh, or are you just gonna uh, actually, go straight gotta, into eight four? Actually, I, I need to. I've gotten the first run of everything through eight three done, and for what I need, it's it's. I got a hundred percent everything, so I I'm debating whether or not to move on to eight four and get the first run through done, or if I should just go back and hundred percent one through three, and then get and then start. Now I do the most one thirty, one forty. Okay. I know you said don't worry about the help, but I'm OCD and I can't stand seeing the help on the screen. So <laughs> <laughs> there is a way to kick that to the bottom so you don't have to see it. Uh, so now we're getting into the stupid easy matches. Nice. Uh, Cisco, I don't have the patience to do a 20 win streak. Oh, I had, I cannot stand grinding arena. Cannot stand it. The fact that I'm doing this now and Rizzo too. Rizzo cannot stand arena at all. You know, I'm old school. Like I, I will still recommend to people like, especially newer players oh, i tell everybody i tell everybody this is the rotation to do while you're trying to get through things once you get to that point that you oh, don't an, have a ton of energy build up run your energy out as soon as you get done with your energy go to the arena until you and your energy is refreshed and then go back to uh, back and keep working on story mode Yes, it's you hit availability and that will kick uh, all the uh, help buttons all the way to the bottom. Got so it. you won't even see them. And then you can avoid hitting that help button. So is the help button really that useless? Uh, it only increases the time if everybody in your, if the, if 10 people in your alliance, cause that's the max that can actually help you, it decreases the timer on them refreshing by half an hour. Come on. Really? So, not really. I'm talking about cheapest. I mean, it, it's it's great when you're talking. First off, it's great when you're trying to do like content and you're and you just need energy. Um, but for arenas, when you have this deep of a roster and you're going through the roster anyways, you'll get back to your your champions will refresh before you before. It, they're not. It's really not going to do enough of a difference on the refresh timer comparatively to what you're going to get through anyways by the time you get through it's it's pointless <coughs> all right 193 now so we are gaining that win streak and sheila just whooped me up one side and down the other she is gorgeous that was embarrassing I got a lot of flack for rank three and her without uh, actually knowing how to play her because, you know, we pulled her during the necro stream. But I have not been disappointed. I think I just pulled her out of the featured. I am a little jealous that you got Kachala uh, because she's one of the few that I don't have. The only two I don't have is Onslaught and Bullseye. I just got Onslaught a couple weeks ago. I actually uh, bought my uh, featured from the Black ISO market, and like after, 
you know, I that's the only feature I'll do these days is the black ISO market one. Um, because it's just I've spent too many extra shards for absolutely no reason at this point. Yeah, if I could hit onslaught and bullseye, I'll be done. Um, I worked for a couple um uh day labor places in Des Moines before I moved out here, but um I haven't found which one to are actually like have easy and a able to do like what I haven't found a good day labor place here yet. I did actually just get some good information that I'm I'm checking into right now. Um, surprisingly enough, in spite of the fact that every place else in the world, Microsoft is a huge deal. Apparently, here in C in the Seattle area, they're m it's more of a uh, get into the industry type of job for most people. Um, so I am looking in to see if I can't maybe get on. Um, what are you doing to uh, find jobs? Are you using like an, uh, a recruiting app or anything? Uh, mostly I've been going through Indeed. Okay, I was going to recommend that. I just signed up for Indeed as an employer and uh, put a job posting out, and I'm constantly uh, getting applicants. I've hired two so far in the last couple weeks off of it. Nice. Uh, yeah, I don't know I have to, if you have, I have to, to update pay for my it or LinkedIn. not. No, no, no. As, as a as an as a potential employee, it is free. Okay, the employers pay to put the job listing open. Yeah, um, I, thought, I do. I thought that's how that worked. Yeah, it's kind of like a dating app. You know, the girls get it for free, and the guys have to pay for it. Yep. <laughs> um but yeah i i gotta get back in uh, i'd actually got reminded to me that i i need to update my linkedin profile again mostly because i kind of let it slide because i haven't really been looking for a while um up until these last couple months I also uh, have had a couple friends that are currently uh, reaching out and um, contacting anybody they know in the area that might be able to put the word out for me and maybe get me a foot in the door someplace. I'm gotcha. Still waiting on some, you know, word on that, but... One of the downsides to being someplace that you've never been before and that you don't know anybody, um, which I mean, that's going to slowly change over the next few weeks, but I don't have a few weeks left right now. So what job are you applying for when you put your uh, resume out? Uh, most... Mostly my, my background is in sales. Gotcha. But I'm open to anything, but I, that's where a lot of the, because I have my marketing degrees, I have my retail management degrees, I have um, years of sales experience, Indeed automatically flags me as sales and marketing. Gotcha. Oh, sorry. I mean, not that I haven't done a lot of things otherwise. Like I spent two, I spent two years as a grade taker. More appropriately, you know, my proper title was grounds foreman for a cemetery, but you know, grave digger sounds funner. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> it's one of the coolest jobs I ever had. To be truthful with you.
I actually, um, when I was in my early 20s, I was assistant manager of oh. Radio Shack. And um, I was the top salesperson for the entire Midwest working for Radio Shack when I was working there. And uh, telling your age on that one, at you? <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 100%. Funny enough, there's actually a Radio Shack that still exists here in the Seattle area. I was shocked when I found it. Oh, wow. Yeah. Um, but uh, I, uh, like I said, I was top salesperson to the point where I ended up getting promoted to assistant manager. And one year that I was working there, we had a competition, a sales competition. Uh, sponsored by Sprint, again, telling my age. Um, and the store, the, the each region's store that sold the most phones, uh, their manager got a free trip to Las Vegas and had a chance to win a car. As oh, wow. the person who as the person who actually sold all those phones and um, being the assistant manager, um, well, my manager got to go to Vegas and uh, live it up for a week and Uh have a chance to win a car. I got an extra week of work because I had to do my job and his, and I got a $200 cell phone. And that was my room. Um, didn't exactly think that was fair, especially in my twenties, and uh, I, I wasn't exactly the uh, quiet type about certain things. <laughs> and so the next year, when the competition got announced again that they were going to be doing it again that next year, uh, they had a big district wide meeting where we had almost every employee in the district in a single room talking to the sprint rep that was announcing it and they're putting out all this information and everything. And I, I raised my hand and I said, uh, you know, uh, our assistant manager is going to qualify for the trip this year, or is it still just going to be the manager that gets the trip? And, uh, they're like, no, 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 no. of course it's just the managers. They're the ones that get it. Like, you know, it's their stores. And again, mouthy 20 year old, not really understanding how much I'm about to shoot myself in the foot. I said, <laughs> Oh, so assistant managers get fucked again. And my <laughs> district manager proceeded to grab me out of the meeting or yank me out and fire me on the spot. Uh, ouch. Yeah. Seems to be a bug. You press the bell almost twice already. <laughs> <laughs> oh, just awaken Hyperion? No way. Nice. Oh, he does hit like a truck. A lot of people don't realize how good Hyperion is because he's so far down compared to some of the other Cosmics, but he really has never lost his value. And being a seven star, even more so. That is crazy. What does his awaken ability do? I know he doesn't uh, need it, but I think it helps. If I remember right, it increases the rate of his uh, power gain. Uh, if that's it, then that's pretty valuable. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's it's sick how quickly you can just walk through your specials. But after I uh, got let go from that job, of assistant manager of Radio Shack. My surrogate father at the time ran the cemetery that I ended up working for. And I was living with them. And he's like, well, you got rent to pay and I got a job for you. Oh. <laughs> um, I'm guessing very similar to the uh, conversation that you've had with Awesome early on. <laughs> um, and... Uh, I was like, okay, whatever. I guess I'll go be summer help and, you know, and, and at least make some money until 
whatever. And then the assistant foreman that was working there at the time got a wild hair up his butt and decided he was moving all the way to the south on a whim and quitting. Uh. And so I went from summer help to the assistant foreman. Um, and makes, I'm like, okay, cool. Makes his so, boss 70% better. Oh, that's huge. Yeah. <clears throat> Go ahead. And then, and then, uh, I learned how to run the backhoe. I learned how to how to do a lot of the stuff that needed to be done, which learning how to run the backhoe was an extremely fun time too. I um, love running a backhoe. Oh yeah, I, it's probably the it, I've ran several heavy machinery before, and running a backhoe was probably one of the funnest things I've ever done. I loved running. Um, and like I got to the point that I was good enough I could dig a grave in forty five minutes. Oh, not bad. Which you would think would scare boys off when I tell them that when they go to try and date my daughter, but it's amazing how stupid young boys are. <laughs> but yeah. Uh, <laughs> um. So I. Uh, I, I'm. I'm assist. Uh, I, I'm. You know, basically the only other employee that works year round there and uh my surrogate father at the time had been working there for years and like was being massively underpaid especially considering like anytime the truck broke the dump truck broke down anytime the backhoe broke down anytime the mowers broke down you name it that man fixed fixed it 90 percent of the time it had to be pretty severe to send it to a shop um, and like he said, he was saving the money left and right. And he went to the, um, head of the cemetery and he said, you know, I, I I'm, I'm just not going to keep doing this. You're either going to give me a raise and put me to a point that's semi relevant to the amount of money that I'm saving you guys, or I'm I'm going to take a job opportunity I have in Minnesota and you're SL, uh, SOL. <laughs> and, and the guy was like, ah, oh, no, you've worked here forever. You're not going anywhere. You're just whatever. We're not, we can't do that. And he didn't believe him. And then all of a sudden dad put in his two week notice and was like, yep, I'm like, I've already set up my moving arrangements. I've, got a new job waiting i'm I'm going to minnesota i'm gonna go install cable for a living and well all of a sudden tony realized that uh dad was gone and he just okay well i guess you're now foreman (laughs) (laughs) and i'm like okay cool and then the first time the truck broke down i was like uh so uh what shop am i supposed to call and he's like, um, what do you mean? What shop are you supposed to call? I'm like, I don't know how to fix it. Like, really? I'm like, I'm not a mechanic. <laughs> I know how to drive it, but don't ask me to fix it. Yeah, I'm like, I'll drive, I'll drive the damn wheels off of it. I'll do, I'll do anything you want done with it behind the wheel of it. But you better have somebody else to fix it when I'm done with it. Oh. He figured out real quick how much money dad was saving them and uh, wasn't really happy when he found that out. Uh, Cisco Kid says he wants a seven star gallon. That would be phenomenal. So, for his gallon, even a seven star? It's a good question. Mm-hmm. Oh. At this point, we get so many seven stars added to the game all the damn time, which is funny because they always talked about how how slow the rollout of seven stars were going to be. But, uh... Yeah, they lied. Yeah. 
No, Gallon is not available as a seven star. Cisco is not happening. At least not yet. Well, that ain't fair. <laughs> I was pretty sure he wasn't because he's just, he is that good of a champion that, like, it's going to be a minute till he hits that pool. Surprised we haven't gotten rated yet. We're at that time of night, honestly. There's a lot of people that will be live for a while. No! <laughs> I hear you, Cisco. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think he's overrated. I think he's got his purposes. You got to realize that uh, Cisco just learned or recently learned how to uh, properly play Hercules. And went from, I don't understand why everybody likes Hercules to, oh my God, I love Hercules. Ah, uh, it's amazing how that happens. My headphones are about to fall off. I got to get through this fight. It's like when I uh, convinced you to use Hulk for that eight point point or eight points three point six, and you were like, "Oh, okay." <laughs> oh, come on. I know I'm not that terrible at the game. I do. I never used him in 10 years. Don't talk crap. <laughs> I'm not talking crap. Oh, great. I mean, Hyper Hyperion is one of the two Marvel wow. Super... Well, no, we're at three Marvel Supermen in game now <laughs> don't talk crap <laughs> yeah that uh man god just whooped me nothing i did i was passive and he was passive and aggressive all at the same time perry wasn't working fun little trivia fact there for you trip uh, there are three champions in this game that are designed in the comics are designed to be the Marvel equivalent of Superman. Do you know who those three champions are? Hyperion is one. Yes. I'm going to guess Strife is number two. Nope. Strife is actually Cable. So in the game or in the comics or is it both? It, 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 there, there are three champions that are in the game, but in the comics they are, they are Superman, just the Marvel version of him. And they are in the game. Yes. One of them, okay. in the game, one of them is a complete and total dud. And one recently was a dud, but got a buff. All right, you challenging me now. <laughs> Okay, it's too early for me to think. <laughs> <laughs> so the three of them are obviously, like we said, Hyperion. Uh, that that which, was obvious. Yeah, he uh, he is actually at the. They actually brought an entire equivalent of the Justice League in, and Hyperion was the Superman of that team. Um. Wizard was the it was Flash. There was a few others. I won't go through them all because it's not really what we're talking about. And none of the rest of them are in the game. Um, 
But the other two are Century. Okay. Who is the dud. Okay. And uh, Gladiator. Who I am using right now, and I almost said it as soon as I saw him pop up. <laughs> I did think Sentry for a minute, but uh, I did I did not say it. I was uh, definitely off key on that one. Cisco, uh, him and I talk all the time several years since he's been in many of my alliances um but yeah. he's actually been talking to me about how on one of my streams because we we i i tell him about different things from the marvel comics all the time now mind you my knowledge is not 100 percent up to date because sure like they change things in marvel all the time um but uh He's been he's been trying to get convince me that I uh, for a stream what I should do is uh, actually go through and discuss Marvel knowledge. There you go. Yeah, uh, AA, uh, a city animations. Yeah, yeah, he's really good about. It. Like those is really, questions. yeah, one hundred percent. That's like when I uh, when I started that new account last summer. Um, I thought it was really obvious what the name on it was, and still to this day, nobody's guessed what the initials on it stand for. What are the initials? Uh, JLH. J L H. Yep. Yeah, I'm gonna make a fool out of myself, probably. <laughs> I mean, supposedly they told us in school there were no dumb questions. So, I mean, yeah, the only stupid question is one you didn't ask. Is what I tell the guys at work. J L H. There is a champion in the. There's actually two champions in the game that it actually stands for, and it is technically the exact same person. That's a good trivia question there. <laughs> I mean, it's a hundred percent the exact same person. It, it's just a different variant on that person. It's actually just a different period in his life, more appropriately. Well, when you say the same person, I'm thinking Void and Century. Nope. Are technically the same person. Appreciate they it, are. Nathan. I'm glad um, you wasn't here to see that uh, fight against. Uh, who was it that just whooped my butt? Mangog. Yes, yeah, yeah. so, uh, Boyd is Century's alternate personality. He actually has a split personality, and Boyd is the other side of it. He is not the only person in Marvel Comics, nor the only person in this game with a split personality. We managed to make it past Maul. Hallelujah. I love wrecking Maul with Tigra. Well, we done it with uh, Spider-Man. Yeah. Dex fight is always good as long as you get those dexes in. All right. We're just a win or two away from hitting the 50 million. 
it's also part of the reason why I was why I was more drawn to uh, Marvel than I was DC as a kid was because Marvel characters aren't perfect. They have real life issues. Uh, we are running out of boost as well. Definitely. So technically, I just dropped three different trivia questions at once, but let's go back to the original one of who, what JLH stands for. Is it an initial or is it a phrase? It's an initial. It is a actually. There's four ver, uh, three versions of the champion in the game. I totally forgot about the third one. He may be one of the few champions in this game that there are three different with three different periods of his life that are represented in this game. Yeah, I'm drawing a blank right now. James Logan Hallett. Oh, uh, old man Logan. Old man Logan, Wolverine, and Weapon X. That's pretty good. Now, I, uh, Logan, I think, is my favorite film of the X-Men. Yeah, it they it was the first time that they actually did Wolverine full justice that movie like that was the movie I was waiting for from the time that they started actually doing X-Men movies and yeah I, Logan was so well acted that uh I'm surprised that Hugh Jackman has uh, agreed to come back again after that one I'm not. He said it from the get-go. When when he made Logan, he said there was only one way he would come back. Um, now, mind you, that was also because of the reason why he actually left, um, which I don't know if you know that either. Patrick Swayze? No. Um, the reason, or that's Patrick Stewart, not Swayze, but... Sorry. Yes, that one. <laughs> I got the first name um, right. Yeah, you did. Uh, the reason, actually, that Hugh Jackman was originally going to step away from the role is because he uh, contracted cancer. Okay. Um, and, you know, the workout routine, maintaining that uh -huh. while you're going through chemo is just absolutely horrendous. Really brutal, yeah. Luckily enough, he did pull through the cancer. So, which... I will tell you, when I first heard about um, Hugh Jackman being cast as Wolverine, I threw an absolute fit. <laughs> um, In a good way? No, no, no. I, w I was very upset about it originally. Really? Okay, so you got to realize that first off, I, I was in my 20s when the first, well, the first X-Men movie came out. Um, and I'd grown up being a huge Wolverine fan. Gotcha. Uh, and in the comics, Wolverine is five foot three. Uh-huh. Okay, Hugh Jackman is six foot two. Not to mention on top of that, before he got casted as Wolverine, pretty much everything he had been known for was musical. Okay. So you just casted a guy that's known for for being, you know, in musicals, as my all time favorite champ and my all time favorite character in comics of period, and like Wolverine's favorite, uh, Wolverine's main catchphrase is, "I'm the best at what I do, and what I do ain't very nice." Yeah. Okay. And, and, I don't see a lot of people in musicals that I'm like, yeah, you're a badass. <laughs> so, like, you got a guy that's way too big, that's been in musicals forever, and you just cast him as one of the most badass characters in all of comics. 
that just didn't set well with me at first. But to this day, I, I'm very happy to see him coming back, and, and it's it's going to hurt when they finally do recast him. Yes. It is definitely not. Well, they'll they'll probably find somebody to do just as good, especially with the animations and stuff the way they are now. Yeah. They, they'll, they'll make whoever, you know, fit the part. Um, now, uh, by the time, he, especially, you know, after the first movie and stuff and watching him do well with it and realizing that a lot of that was Fox and, um, God, I can't believe, Brian Singer, uh, were, did not do justice to the X-Men by any means. Got it. Um, there were a lot of things that that I came out of that. Like, I, 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 I have a lot more respect for the movies now that I'm older. Um, but there was a lot of things about the original movie that, like, a 20-year-old me was so pissed. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, the fact that um, Iceman, Iceman in the movie is a student. I wasn't okay with that. Sci-fi, how are you doing? Appreciate you coming in. Join the Alliance yesterday. Hope you're doing, man, I'm doing good. I should be in the bed. It's 1230 now. And, uh, it's starting to catch up to me. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> we just hit 50 million points. We started the stream at 35 million. So we've gained 15 million in just under three hours. Uh, I'm hitting the uh, help button against Wu's uh, advice. Just because I'm like fixing to start going cross-eyed. <laughs> <laughs> and uh starting to have some choppy gameplay i can feel it uh starting to come on uh 205 win streak we have set a record for my account for the longest win streak um let's see but, there yeah, like a said, lot of helps <laughs> you know Iceman is one of the original X-Men mind you he was the youngest of the original X-Men but to have Storm and everybody else's teachers and still have him as a student like like I said that was one of those things that bothered me as a 20 year old gotcha alright so we got some hell divers going on with Cataclysm and Triple G. Now, yeah. before you switch over, I did ask one other trivia question, and I'm going to go ahead and yep, answer. Yep, yep, yep. Um, like I said, Century, the reason why we have two different champions that are technically Century in here, in spite of the fact that they should both be one champion, um, is because of his split personality, which is what causes Void to exist. Do you know the other champion in the game with a split personality? This one, because I know you're getting tired and stuff, I will give you a hint. Yeah, he I, to has a I totally missed the whole question. I'm not going to lie to you. <laughs> <laughs> I caught something about has a split personality. I said, other than Century, do you know who the other champion in the game that has a split personality is? And the hint that I'm going to give you is he does have a Disney Plus series. Oh, Hawkeye and Ronan? Nope. That's not a split personality. That's he was pissed and just <sighs> decided to stop being the good guy and start doing what the hell he could. <laughs> All right. So... 
personality, huh? My biggest grind was for Bullseye at one point, no, 120 million in the arena. That's a lot of points. Yeah, that's pretty did, average. Did you get? Did you get Bullseye at 120 million, or did you fall short? That's the question. Um, uh, split personality, and has a Disney Plus series. Yes. It ain't Loki, is it? Nope. Okay. You've eliminated two of the series. All right, so let's go through it. WandaVision. Nope. <laughs> Winter Soldier. Nope. Uh, do, 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 do. A Disney Plus series. All right, you got me. Moon Knight. Ah. Uh, you did get him. Oh, nice. That that makes a big difference. Yeah, I think I've reached the uh, I've reached my six star rank ones. So I'm definitely not going up very fast right now on the points. I think that I may uh try to take me a small nap and get back up uh, after they refresh let's uh, go availability so an hour and a half an hour and a half alright so my big guys are about an hour and a half out two hours out Let yeah. me know how long you think you can sleep for and get back up, and I will join you back on stream if you want. I'm not going to make any promises, because as soon as I say I'm going to, I'm not. Oh, I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I know. I get it. Trust me. Um, but if 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 you get back up and decide you're going to go live, like, let me know, and I... Like I'll be I'll be here to help help because I know you're gonna be tired on this next one. Let's I know what these rides are like. Eleven ten. So it's nine forty where you are. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I may attempt to do like a three hour nap and then get mm -hmm. back up. Um. And then come back. Um. I got plenty to do over the next several hours that I could I could easily kill some time and be available when, if you make it back up. Um, uh, come on now. I can't spell. There we go. Uh, let's go on over to Abdo stream and uh, let's raid him. Uh, for those of you that are still here watching and grinding out with me, uh, let's go ahead and Head over to Abdo and give him a shout. And then we'll come back for part two here in a couple of hours. I'd say we're going to try to maybe do a three, four hour nap and then come back. That works for me, bro. I can definitely. So yeah. maybe we can get some of the Australians at that point to come in. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. That'll be a great time for it. All right. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Appreciate you. Thank you.